you guys what's up guys how are you guys doing okay guys so you're welcome back to my channel and you're welcome back to today's video so in today's video i'm basically going to be showing you a very very great and yet very helpful ingredient that would actually help you to smoothen out your face now if you've actually been wondering but like been looking for a way to you know smoothing out your face to get that glow to get that uniform complexion to remove wrinkles and to tighten up your face the more okay so this is it if you've actually used some creams that has actually destroyed your face or if you do not actually like the way your face is or if you actually do not if you have actually been experiencing or be seeing wrinkles and a little bit of fine lines here and there okay you're in the right video because this particular ingredient that i'm going to be showing you would help you in all of that it will help you to stay healthy it will help you to look healthy it will help you to smoothen out your skin so let me walk you through down this video watch the video till the very end because i have more details i'm going to be showing you in the video okay as the video goes on okay so let me take you right into the video in today's video i'm going to be showing you a great way to remove all of those tiny bumps on your forehead you know all of those tiny tiny pimples all right so if you're actually experiencing those tiny pimples on your forehead or on your face literally this treatment is actually for you and you are at the right video because the ingredients today are very simple and there's something that you can actually you know quickly find all right so this I have here is sugar and you can actually use white sugar for this um, tiny bombs remedy okay because sugar contains a smaller granite particles that helps your skin glow really really fine so I just put in two tablespoons of sugar okay which is perfect and then also we're going to be making use of green tea all right, so you have to um, you have to put in the green tea particles, okay, in the bag. All right, so green tea is an amazing ingredient that helps so much to um, make your skin look healthy. And it actually helps to remove tiny bumps. It helps for pimples, and it equally helps to get rid of darkness on your skin. Literally. So we're also going to be making use of lemon, guys. Lemon is an amazing ingredient that actually helps the skin glow. It contains vitamin C that makes your skin lighter because it scrubs out all of the blemishes, dark spots and it helps to make your skin even out. So I'm going to put in it bit by bit just a little here and there so that it won't actually be too much for this. Then we're going to be making use of honey okay i'm going to be telling you the three important ingredients that you must not skip because this particular one has a lot of ingredients okay so i'm going to be at the end of the video i'm going to be telling you even if you want to skip some you cannot skip some okay so do not worry keep on watching all right guys so honey is a great moisturizing agent that helps to moisturize the skin and make the skin glow up really really fine so when you use honey on your skin it will make your skin smoother and then it will make your skin look really clear okay so I'm gonna be putting two tablespoons of my honey
Okay, this is an important ingredient. Okay, so what I'm going to this is ginger. You'll be needing ginger a whole cooking lot in this particular bombs treatment. So I'm actually not even peeling it, but I'm going to be creating it just like that. But if you want to peel yours, guys, you can as well peel it. It's ideal even if you want to peel it. Okay. Alright, so this is it. And then I'm gonna be I'm gonna be squeezing in the juice. Consider. Oh, sorry. I just need to just the juice in here. All right, keep on watching so you can you can see how I'm gonna be applying this. So the very important ingredient that shouldn't be skipping this particular one is the lemon. The ginger and the honey. So, if, even if you don't want to use the rest too, it is okay. But you shouldn't skip lemon, ginger, and honey. Okay. All right. So let me go apply this onto my forehead and show you how effective this could. Because I actually experienced some little rashes on my forehead, and that's why I'm actually making this video. Okay. Okay, guys. So this is your um, this is your forehead balm remedy. Okay, this is how it looks like. All right. It smells good too. So what you do is that you apply this into your forehead. Like I myself, I do have rashes on my forehead right now and I do need this a whole lot okay okay guys so after which you've applied it onto your forehead this is how it's gonna be looking like okay so after that then you can gently gently rub it you can gently rub it this way okay just gently now this is actually going to you know poke off all of those bones like little little tiny bones here and there it's gonna just poke them and it is better for the sugar to poke them okay because when it's when it poke them it's going to get into the skin than for you to actually use your hand to you know cook it and cook it okay so it is better you do it this way so that it will cook it and then your skin will be literally smooth okay so after which you've done this if you if you feel that you want to apply it again you can do that you know apply a generous quantity you can as well do that okay Okay, so after which you have done that. Now for this particular ingredient, you can actually put it in an airtight container and then seal it up and then you will be using it every evening okay, or every morning when you wake up. If you feel the, the bumps or the pimples or the breakouts is everywhere on your face, you can literally just apply it everywhere and that is actually going to help you to remove all of those facial bones and all of that okay so that is that every day for as long as those things are on your face till they go that's when you stop using this okay so after which you've done that now you would have to use a uh, warm towel you know or you use a normal room temperature since if it's actually a heat time just like this time that i have now you know i prefer to use a normal room temperature water to clean my face but if it's actually a normal time or raining time you know or cold season you use a warm towel when it comes to you know pimples or 
or bumps like that on your face. Okay. Okay, guys. So you clean it just like this. And after which you've cleaned it, then you can actually go wash this and then, you know, um, clean it up. Now, continue using this till you actually see a whole lot of improvements onto your skin, yo. Okay? So, that's it, guys. So, you guys, that's it. You can actually apply this onto your face and basically scrub it out. Leave it for a little while, just as I said in the video. And it's going to help to rejuvenate, to help keep your face healthy, help make you look beautiful, help to rejuvenate and keep you looking so, so young. Okay? So, that's it. I'll see you again in my next video. And do not forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and share the video. And I'll see ya. Bye, guys.